CAR T-cell therapy is the newest form of immunotherapy that we're currently offering here at Robert Wood Johnson University Hospital and Rutgers Cancer Institute of New Jersey. Currently, it's being offered for patients with uh, recurrent uh, acute lymphocytic leukemia and for patients with refractory diffuse large B-cell lymphoma. CAR T-cell therapy is where patients own T-cells, which are an immune system cell that are important in recognizing infections and other cancer cells are essentially removed from the patient and then in a the laboratory they're modified or engineered so that they can better recognize cancer cells and attack them. These cells are then reinfused into the patient via a single infusion which is similar to a blood transfusion. Chemotherapy generally kills cells that grow fast but it's not very specific and that's why there can be hair loss and infections, it's kind of non-specific. CAR T-cell therapy is very specific therapy. It is using the patient's own immune system to go after the lymphoma and to do it in a very targeted, effective fashion. One of the novel aspects of this therapy is that the CAR T-cells uh, remain in the patient's uh, system for months, possibly years. It's completely unlike any other drug that uh, we use because the other drugs basically disappear from the system. In contrast, the CAR T cells first expand and then remain again for months or years, and in that sense can be considered a living drug. What follows is a unique set of side effects that can occur. The good news is that these symptoms are completely reversible and temporary. Our specialized staff of physicians and nurses are certified and trained to promptly recognize these symptoms and manage them. On the scan on the left, this was the patient's last PET CT scan before he got the CAR T cells. And you can see that he has a very bright mass. All of this was resistant to chemotherapy. The scan on the right, looking at the very same areas, you can see that you, you no longer see anything uh, lighting up. And so that's about as good as you can get for a PET CT scan. One of the things I appreciate about being here at Robert Wood Johnson University Hospital and Rutgers Cancer Institute of New Jersey, one of 49 NCI-designated comprehensive cancer centers in the country, is the ability to not only offer this therapy, but to be able to contribute to studies which improve the efficacy and reduce the toxicity. When that first and especially second line of chemotherapy does not work, options in the past were really quite limited. Now, when we have a treatment such as CAR T-cell therapy, it is a game changer. We are literally treating patients that had very few options, and the treatment is effective in that it is not only going into complete remission at a very high rate, we're hopeful that it is permanent, in other words, curative therapy. 